Okay, I restarted another one, and uh, let's see where I'm at. It should be 128 feet away. Okay, I see me now. I'm going to get directly over me. Let me drop out of the clouds just a little bit, too. Here's my car. on it. Okay, I'm centered, and now I'm going to do a clapper with an arm wave. Uh, two. Right. Left. And that's got to synchronize. Now then, we're looking directly to east. Really, my map up here. No, I'm sorry, that's directly due west. Yep. It's a good thing for pilot to know. 38 feet away from me, the height of 280 feet, and you roll up to the vertical. That's still a lot of cloud cover. Let me fly a little bit out here, a few hundred meters up. Okay, I'm flying directly due east. And currently I'm about uh, 400 feet away. This looks like some of the edge of this property back here. I'm now at uh, 1,000 feet away. I drop down out of the clouds. Come around here and get some panoramic. A little bit in the clouds, but cancel this. Go home. Okay. At height of 266 feet, I still need to drop down a little bit. Facing directly due east. Okay, now this is directly due west. Uh, actually, northwest is where I'm traveling right now. I have the 230 feet. I'm going to drop down just a little bit. I'm getting closer to where I am. I'm flying about the extension of these limits of the satellite beacon. 269 feet away. Get up, out of, up from underneath some more cloud cover. Now, this should be thoroughly good to get a, a accurate USGS uh, on here. Damn it, 948 feet. There's some stuff down here. I'm at a thousand feet and uh, it looks like on the map, let me pull this up and see where I'm at. Um, Yeah, it's hard for me to see anything on this map. It's not going to let me. Um, come back over here, though. I'm now at 1,100 feet away. Pick up a little bit out. No, let me drop a little bit out to you. Now at 150 feet. Turn back around and look at me. where I'm directly underneath at 1,024 feet away. I'm just going to fly some with this uh, lower altitude. About 900 feet away. Flying back towards me. It looks like the southeast. Mosquitoes out here today. Roll this up. I get back on the street so I can get a little better. And I'm trying to be about 900 feet away.
Okay, I'm back directly over me now. I'm going to fly back here east. Let me cancel my go home. I'm at 61% batteries. 195 feet. Eight hundred and seventy feet away, thousand feet away. One thousand two hundred feet away. And a little bit of cloud cover, so changing my exposure up just a little bit. Now on this recording for seven minutes and one second. Looking north, looking northeast, getting a little bit of altitude. I'm going to come back over the road and strafe it to the left. One thousand two hundred eighty feet away. I need to hide the 342. Let me see if I can. And send it go home. Let me get a little bit back into range. I'm at 53% of my battery. My cancel go home. Okay. Now I'm, I'm looking at a little southeast. I'm at 800 feet away. I'm going to get over the road and then strafe it west while looking north to give a little bit more of a bird's eye view on the thousand feet away. I'm using signal. Uh, the clouds are clearing up a little bit though. I'm going to raise my camera up. Okay, cancel go home again. A thousand feet. Look over here now and do what I wanted to do, which is roll my camera up and strafe west while looking north. Let me drop some altitude and get out of the clouds a little more. I'm going to drop more altitude. I'm at 400 feet. Okay, I'm almost back over me. I'm going to go a little bit west to the extent of the limit. Drop down out of this cloud cover. Gimbal up. I'm at 180 feet. Uh, I'm going to do some ground flying. Hmm, I hear a life flight in the air. Okay, now I'm going to strafe. Align myself. Holy shit, 56 feet. That's not good. Gimbal up. Gimbal down shows me on position on the roadway. The fence row. Let's see if I can strafe now. Got a vehicle. Okay. 
and i'm strafing for about ninety feet.